If you have pain in your spine or shoulders, the spine and shoulder integrator can give you relief and help you feel better. Use a towel or a pillow to rest your head parallel to the floor. Position your body on your side, making a 90 degree, 90 degree angle with your knees, thighs, and torso. We'll start by putting our hand on the forehead and moving our head with our hand in a rotation manner, using our, our eyes to track the ceiling and see how far are we moving. The second motion will allow us to stabilize our torso and focus only on the movement of our knees. Very, very important to feel this motion and sense how it opens up the lower back uh, region. Gently sliding your knee on top of each other. The third motion is a complete motion where we'll integrate the previous uh, movements. As slowly as lie your hand. And again, paying attention to the sensation of your skin. Slowly start moving into longer distances and sense the skin of your hand, your forearm, and how you transfer into the fabric of the t-shirt. Very important to understand that these motions are to be done slowly and the short motion too. Again, this will enrich your nervous system where you will bring more awareness to the sensation and the small increments of movement will increase the accuracy of your movement. Very important to release your rib cage as we open up. Focus on expanding your rib cage and move one vertebrae at a time as you're rolling. Continue focusing on your breath and slowly move in there. These exercises are best to be done early in the morning and at night or during the day. If you're in pain, you can do this you know, as many times as you want. Take your time to, re to rest after you do one part of the body. If you have time, do the other side also. If you need to move the support for your neck so you can feel better on your back, you can do so and continue to, to rest. Make sure you continue moving on moving every day and never give up.